Hello, everybody. How's it going? Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac. With me, Milby. I hope you're doing good. I know you hope you're ready for another run. What are we going to go for today? Well, we didn't have quite the success of Eve that we were hoping for. Let's see if we have any more success with a dead baby. <laughs> I don't know why I would think that, but uh, who knows? Maybe we will. All right, we're going to do our best here to uh, play like the pros do and not get hit. I need to I need to not get so bummed out when I when I take damage in this. Sometimes it really like bums me out. I just need to I just need to learn to uh roll with the punches. I need to learn to roll the punches and when when I take damage I take damage and that's going to happen because that's part of this game is uh shit happens. Unless you're playing with the lost, in which case you don't roll the punches. You sit there and you uh start to shake uncontrollably. Until eventually your particles separate and you can travel through walls. No, you just shake until you just want to explode. Because of the loss, of course, you can't die. You can't get hit. You can't die. You can't die as anyone. You're not, wait, well, can. You don't want to. <laughs> ah, dead baby. Only soul hearts, no real hearts. Little health up options will just give you more soul hearts. Dead baby can, uh, can kind of suck. But it can also be really awesome with certain uh, item synergies. Uh, mm -hmm. That sucks, but it's okay. That was some silly damage there, but that's all right. Uh, are we on XL floor? We are. I didn't even realize we're in an XL floor. Oh god, that was another. See that? I'm not letting get, not letting myself get annoyed by that though. Nope. <laughs> not letting myself get annoyed by the silly damage that's making me want to punch a fire in the face. That is Gemini. Cancer, damn. So hearts, so that gives us soul hearts, and we have, I think we had that in the last run. And it gives us a um, creepy weird body. And as well as all of that <laughs> combined, it gives us the ability to, uh, when we get hit, it will give us a shield, which will basically act like the wafer does, and that will uh, take down the damage that we, uh, deal to like basically half a heart at most. And then there's an Anemiac, which puts our range up. Apparently. I don't know why it says that. I think that's wrong. Uh, but I know what it does do. It leaves a trail of the of the, of the the blood creep when I get hit. Basically. It's uh, Lazarus has this as a starting item. Well, Lazarus, this happens to, this, well, Lazarus gets this item when he resurrects after his first death. Because that's what Lazarus can do. All right, that's a fake rock right there. I was checking out um, fake rocks. Pictures of them again. Man, those utero ones are tough to see. Nice, there's a soul heart there. That's a good start. Let's uh, let's try and take care of these guys from a, uh, a healthy distance. So we don't have to uh, deal with all the nonsense they'll be spewing everywhere. All the hate and lies. Two hearts, that's actually of no use to us at all with the dead baby, because all that will do is double my current amount of hearts. So the dead baby, that is actually 100% useless. But, uh, hey, you never know, maybe uh, maybe someone, maybe we'll leave that there. Maybe someone in desperate need will come along and find it and be like, hey, hey, that's a really good card. I'm glad I found that. Okay, let's go back in there. Didn't mean to go in there then. All right, that's given us a golden chest. We need a key to get in there, which is right there. And it's a pill. We don't know what that'll do yet. I don't know what that'll do. Right, so we could go to the shop. There's a couple of things we can do. But two bosses to fight here as well. So uh, hopefully we'll get a devil deal out of this. Um, let's see. Speed down. Not a great one. I want to go in here. I'm going to open the golden chest because I don't know if I have any money. The money. I'm going to save the money. Oh, it's okay then. We can go into the shop anyway because we have the key. So that's fine. That's fine then. That's all right. Let's go in. 
Right, so there's a key there, bombs, and the champion's belt, which is a damage up, but will also increase the rate at which we'll see champion enemies. And I believe champion enemies, there's a kind of advantage to that in that champion enemies uh, are more likely to drop items. I might just put my money into the donation machine, because that's what I'm really trying super hard to do at the moment. <laughs> so, oh, God. Really, really want to get, uh, really want to get the, the, the donation machine filled up to the absolute brim. Whoa! Pin here, kind of firing out those tears at us. Ugh. Nice. That uh, is Mum's purse. I'll drop a bunch of pills. Uh, we don't know what any of them do, though, so we're going to have to, we're going to have a party right now. We're going to pop a bunch of pills and maybe pass out and die. Health down. Terrible start. Lemon party. All right, bit of a waste. I found pills. Okay. And 48 hour energy. Totally useless with the poo. All right. So that was pretty... Uh, well, at least we know we got uh, health down out of the way. So we know what that's going to be from now on. If You know what? We we know that's... Uh, there's always an advantage. We're using that to... There we go. Use the high priestess card to kill their elf. Nice and fast. Oh, the purple one. That is strength... And speed up. I, I'm i just making that up, but I have no idea. Oh my god! I was so right. Damage and speed up. Strength is what I meant. I meant damage when I said strength. And that's a devil room right there. Let's see what we've got. That's Guppy's head. I could get us in, That could take us one step closer to having Guppy form. That will uh, release blue flies. Um, the, the hive. Usable fly hive, so that basically when we use that, it'll spawn between uh, two and four flies, and which do twice as though it's like do two times the damage my stuff does. And it'll take us a step closer to getting guppy form, which will turn us into a cat, which gives us flying and mulligan. Do I want to spend those hearts? I mean, that'll mean I have two hits basically. It will beat the poop. I'm gonna play a risky game, and I'm gonna take it. And the hopes that it pays off and that I get <laughs> I get what I want. Um I'm just gonna put all this stuff in here. We need that. We could go to the secret room, which could be here. Nice. Give me money in there, yep. Not enough to have gotten the champion's belt, though. So damage isn't too bad. Basically, we're going to have to just be very careful. I'm going like I'm going hard onto the. Uh, I'm getting a hard on for those. I'm getting. I'm going hard onto those uh, donation machines now. There's a lot of items that I want to get from those, and I I need to start donating a lot more. It's going to take me forever to fill those up. Right, so we're gonna make, remember to use these in every room, and just to play. That was that was dumb. That was very dangerous. What I did there, <laughs> very nearly got hit. We have to be very careful. Won't be able to go in those um in those uh, in the curse rooms because uh, those will take away a heart of damage if we're going in those. Is this next cell floor? No, it's just a regular one. Okay, that was terrifying. On as far as going to get hit then. As an advantage though, we do have Libra, so that means when we do get hit, you know, it'll help. Only in that room though. Okay, let's try and take care of these before they get anywhere near me. That was my goal there. Alright, I don't want to go to the boss room yet, because I don't have much health, so if I do get a devil room, devil deal. Um, it would suck because then I won't be able to take advantage of it. Holy shit. Okay, well, lucky me. Uh, that enemy's an idiot and ran into fire, apparently. <laughs> oh, are you kidding me? Demon Baby? Oh, why is Demon Baby just sitting there? What? Oh, that is... Do I, do I take damage just for Demon Baby? I don't know. Demon Baby is not bad. It's not bad at all. Give me flying. 
Spider butt. Oh, now you give me a fucking space brain. So what that does is it slows down enemies in the room and does damage to them. That might actually like come in handy a bit. I think this would probably be more handy. I think I guess the hive will probably be more handy. So I'm gonna keep the hive. I'm I'm kind of regretting taking such a uh, dangerous stance of this run. So far we haven't really got any. I was kind of hoping that soul hearts would start appearing <laughs> and that my risk would kind of pay off but at the moment it's kind of just yeah we're not really seeing any uh, payoff for the what, for the risk I've taken. Secret room could be here. And we can't bomb into the shop because there's that weird bug. Right? Yep. Or possibly it's just a feature. Right, blow them all up. Okay, I was kind of hoping you'd blow them all up, but that's fine. Uh, we'll blow up one more. Oh, oh so good. Right, I'll blow that one as well then. Oh, so good. Mm. Alright, there's the arena with uh, with a golden chest in. Use a key on. Or we can go to the shop. Maybe there'll be a soul heart there. I want to get that. I want to. I want to get the demon baby. Yes. Thank you. Oh, that's a good one. The nun's habit. But unfortunately, I am banning myself. Did I just gain money when I did that? No, I didn't. I'm banning myself from blowing up the donation machine. Uh, for a while. Okay. We're gonna do it. I mean, I could go to the... Kirshimus could have guppy items in, though. That's the thing. Let's do the boss first. That's gonna be a that's gonna be a whole heart I'll lose from going in and out of there. Right, let's do the boss first. See what happens. Oh, this fucker! I hate this dude. Worst reason I don't like this dude because you have to let him get close to you. At least I think you do. <laughs> Which is not part of my plan here. My plan is to stay as far away from enemies as possible. So this guy has a gross noise. Sounds like a kid's toy. Like a crappy kid's dinosaur toy. <laughs> oh, that's a health up and a damage up. That's awesome. Oh my god, little brimstone. Unfortunately, I can't take little brimstone. That'll take me down to one heart and I have stuff I want to do here. It requires me to sacrifice at least a heart. At least. Right, let's, let's do this. Oh my god, what an amazing luck that was. <laughs> okay, so that worked out amazingly. That's going to give us Guppy's Tail, which will increase the chances of getting chests. But so, but uh, alternatively, will also decrease the chances of us getting um, any... Uh, what, any... Gen us getting uh, drops, consumables, like keys, bombs, money. Uh, but that also brings us one step closer to guppy form. And I'm going to take some damage here. Wow, I took a whole heart damage. I didn't know that was going to happen. I was going to take like a half. A half. A half. A half a damage. Took a hole though. Yikes. Was it worth it? I don't know. When we die, it probably won't be. Well, we can't open that up. Could look for the super secret room. I'm gonna put like one bomb there. It's right there. Oh man, that's gonna give us an extra heart. Soul heart, unfortunately. You know. 
An extra heart all the same. So I'll take us up to three. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Caves two. Alright, okay. We're sitting pretty. Three soul hearts. Have to play it safe here. Oh, pay the price. Okay, are we gonna... Hmm. Oh yeah, I've got flies, haven't I? Why are my flies not doing anything? Nice. And it gave me a key to get into the item room. Oh, is that... Tech point five? Yeah, it's tech point five. That gives us a laser in the middle of our head, which will fire randomly, basically. Um, it's pretty good. It's got really no disadvantage to it. As far as I know, there's no like damage down from it, like a lot of other technologies. It will just—it's just a random to firing set. There's like there's no. There's no, uh... Shit. Okay, this is a bit of a weird room. How am I gonna... There you go. Okay. I didn't like that very much. That was kind of, uh, scary. Okay, I hate these guys. Hate these guys. Not a big fan of the Scallon guys. Usually because they're, uh, they're very fast at the bone throw. And, uh, I'm not the fastest reaction guy in the world. So I tend to get hit by them a lot. I'm liking the tech point five though. It's doing the job. Doing the job definitely. Getting a little bit of extra damage on. I'm not sure what the damage if the dam how the damage is affected with tech point five. Okay, so it's equal to my current tier damage. That's actually pretty good. So you could get some pretty beastly. Yeah, so that's actually not bad. So it only fires when I'm firing, but we don't know how often it'll fire. It's totally random there's there's no way to increase the likelihood it seems like like luck isn't it a lot usually a lot of stuff like this is affected by luck it doesn't look like this is affected by luck at all um and it doesn't scale with tier stat with tier increases as well so hey though i got to say it's doing good damage i'm pretty impressed I think I might want to check out the rest of the rooms in this place before I go to the boss. Oh, shit, okay, we have to try and... There we go. Yeah, I don't like that room. Oh god, I almost walked right into the spike sink because I wasn't paying attention. That would have really annoyed me. <laughs> that would have, uh, that would have, that would have, uh, made me mad. You would have seen a mad Milby. <laughs> Howling mad Milby. Oh, that gives us a chance to have piercing shots. Uh... Yeah. No, spectral and piercing, is it? Yeah, so it chance to have spectral and piercing tears. I don't know if it's like a combination of the two, or if it chooses one or the other. Oh, they're both, they're both spectral and piercing. Oh. That's good. So they get a randomly... Random one of those. I like them, but I there's like... I don't really like the fact that I can't control how often they're going to pop up. And now, I could go in there. I'm going to sacrifice a whole heart of health if I do go in there. Ah, now these blood arenas I can actually go into because of the fact that I have only soul hearts. Uh, do I want to go in there, though? I don't know. A key. A key of a kingdom for my key. It could be a gut the item. We're going to sacrifice a heart. For this. Nice. And we gain one back. Oh my god. That is it. That's a guppy form. Eternal life question mark. Guppy's collar. It paid off. Wow, we paid off big time. So that gives us flight. Mulligan. We also have the potential if we die to be resurrected. Now we need to not squander this gift. Uh, we are guppy with a with a ball sack chin. Oh, nice! That's perfect! That means we can go around opening all the um, chests now. Also, I think with the fact we have Mulligan now as well, which spawns blue flies upon you uh, 
hitting enemies, uh, which should work really nicely with Tech Point Five, and the blue flies do, you know, two point oh damage times two damage that you do. Ah, it's a shame I only got this now. Like I, uh, I still haven't done the boss rush as the blue baby yet. It's a shame I only just got this now, as opposed to earlier, so I could rush through. Um, I'm in, I'm in caves too right now. I'm not even in. You know, I've got loads to go. 20 minutes. Hopefully the run will probably pick up speed a bit now. Whoa, I keep forgetting I can fly. <laughs> I was really scared then that I just walked onto spikes. But I forgot I could fly. Taking a lot of risks in this run. And uh, i got to say I'm surprised that they've paid off as well as they have. Um, kind of made me want to take more risks in the future. <laughs> Usually I'm very conservative with this stuff, but... I blown up those mushrooms could give me pills and stuff like that, and the uh, uh, mushroom all stats up or whatever. But okay with it for now. Wow, a lot of keys, a lot of keys. We're gonna go to the uh, uh, shop. Uh, 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 shop. In there. I'm pretty okay with this. I'm just gonna put my money in here again. Okay, well, no more money's going into that then. That's uh, that's done and done. But I want to look for the secret room. I guess I could look for the secret room before we go. It could be there. This is a set room for. Yeah, it could actually be there. Let's check. It is there. Let that open. Pill. Speed down. We don't want that. Let's get that out of our inventory. Ugh. Ugh, gross. All right, here we go. Mega fatty it is. Don't really need Guppy's head anymore. Is there an item around here that I could have changed for it? Oh, there was before, wasn't there? Yeah, I don't really need um, Guppy's head now because we've got the mulligan. Oh, that's a, that's a HP up. Help, a whole HP up. A HP up. A snack that gives us a uh, extra blue heart. Um, Yep, let's go. All right, so at the moment, I'm actually pretty happy with how this is going. Curse of the Lost, not that. That's not made me happy, though. Okay, so now what I need to do is not take a bunch of silly damage and still be careful, because what happens usually with me is I get a good run, and then I get really, really careless. Paralysis. Good time. Good thing I used that, you know, good timing with me using that after the room was cleared and not before. I tend to get a little bit overwhelmed by all the things happening around me with this. With the mulligan, so I like I kind of lose track of what's happening in front of me. But I mean we're not damage wise we're fine. I mean overall stats, which apart from tier rate, which could be a lot better, but the tech point five is kind of making up for that. We're actually pretty decent. Mm, so that's the Arena. Let's go to the arena. Yeah, that's that's okay. As long as this last one isn't uh, anything awful. Uh, could have been better, but luckily we didn't get any uh any hits there. God, I get so lost in these rooms. I'm gonna have to clear these rooms very uh methodically if I want to keep track of. Where I am. Uh, yeah, I don't, flies apparently will just blow themselves up if they run into the back of these guys. I didn't know that. I'm really glad we have the tech. Ah, oh, shit! Didn't mean to do that. Oh boy. Fuck! I am too slow to get out of that. Then. I uh, I tried to go past him, but my speed is too low. Um, it looked like a fake rock, but it's not. What's up here? Oh, God. Those, these rocks here, they have, like, no lighting on them, and it makes them look like they're fake rocks. Like, they have no detailing on them. And it makes them, to me, look like they're fake rocks, even though they're not. Alright, we got Mum's hand coming down there. You can see the shadow coming down. 
Like some old Zelda games. The Empress. That gives us uh, the Whore of Babylon effect for a room. So that'll up our damage and speed, so that could be useful. <laughs> Hello again, Mum's Hand. Twice. Such uh, short uh, breaks. Usually you get quite a few of those at once. Get, just getting one's pretty... Getting one twice in a row as well, it's not that often. Alright, we've got the item room found, so that's a good start. We know that's there. That's the, uh, teleporter? So I'll just randomly teleport us to different rooms. That could actually be pretty fun to play with. I mean, we've got... We don't really need the uh, Guppy's head, because we've got the... Ah, i got a lot of keys at the moment. Because we get... Uh, we've got... What's his face? <laughs> What's his finger jig? We've got, we've got Mulligan. And I think Guppy's head, before when you have Mulligan, is kind of pointless. Okay... I don't know if this guy can actually take you to the I Am Error room or not. Have we missed anything here? Let's warp around, see if we can find... Oh, nice! What a what a fantastic situation. <laughs> Whoa! That was close. I probably shouldn't have taken the Eternal Heart there, but... It doesn't really make much of a difference with this, I suppose. I guess it does a bit. Oh, wow. How do I... Where, did, where is all this? <laughs> I, I See, now, there's a problem with the... Um, that's the problem with taking the warp thing on a, on, a, on a floor where you can't see the map, is you get very lost, because you have no idea where you are in relation to anything anymore. But yeah, that was uh, the remote teleport thing. That's actually came in pretty useful there. I think that's the first time I can ever really say I've been pretty happy to take the remote teleporter. Wealth of Wealth. Sometimes gives you a bonus coin when you pick up extra coins. I like how I get all this after I've already donated as much as I possibly can to the machine. That's fake rock. Soul heart. That's wonderful. Uh, okay, now def there's definitely a shop over here, so we'll go to that. Oh, isn't that double... No. I take that. What is that? Double trinkets? When Isaac is hit, is a chance he'll drop a pickup. That's what Fanny Man says. Hey, you know what? Let's take it. We've got the money. Mm, why not? Blow this guy up. See what we get. <sighs> Nothing. I'm not probably going to troll for the super secret. I mean, for the, I found the super secret room. I'm not going to troll for the secret room here because I um, don't have the map and I can't work out where that is in spatial. Time. Where the hell are we? What? How big is this floor? I don't understand. I thought I'd covered like the whole floor before. Luck down. Not great. But who knows? Maybe now our run will turn to shit. <laughs> uh. Yeah. All right. Key. Coin. All right. I think we're. Actually, where we were before now. Yes, here we are. So the boss room is down here. I think. Yep, there we go. All right, so let's, uh, let's get out of here then. Oh, hello. All right, let's use this guy. Give us some... Uh, fuck. I knew that would happen. I don't like the bloat. I've said it many times. Oh, yeah, you don't lose soul hearts when you have uh, all soul hearts, do you? You don't lo you lose eternal hearts. Health down. I want to get rid of that. Just, it'll never turn to a health up pill as well. Because the... you normally would if you don't have many. If you don't have any health up stuff. If you don't have any health, if you have like one red heart, health down turns to health up. But because this is a, a dead baby run, it changes it. So if you had one soul heart, it would turn to a health up, maybe. What's this one do? Oh god, don't give me that. Oh god, I had that with um, Ippikak and 
Oh my god, yeah, and the Suicide King one. I had that, I had the Wiggly Worm thing, the Wiggly Wiggly Woo Worm thing. Wiggy Wiggly Woo, Wormy's coming for you. And, uh, had that and the Ipecac with the boomerang. So it came out, spun around like a lunatic, and then came back at me spinning like a lunatic, and it was terrifying. I didn't know what to do with myself. Oh, was that Abaddon? Is that Abaddon? If that's Abaddon, I think I'll take that. Yeah, that is Abaddon. So what that does is it uh, removes all of your hearts. Removes all your red hearts. Now, I don't know how that works with this. Uh, if it was just this. Um, and uh, we get a damage up, speed up. Tears will induce, will have a chance to induce fear, um, which is affected by your luck, of course. Do you not have a very good one? So I'm curious. It'll give us all black hearts as well. I'm curious if this works with this guy. Oh, it actually works really well with this guy. Oh my god, if I had red hearts, right, then yeah, it would get rid of them, but with soul hearts, it doesn't get rid of them all. So that just basically, we just sacrificed three soul hearts to gain six black hearts, which will do damage when uh, to enemies when they deplete. And we're going to get an extra soul heart now. So that is actually really, really fantastic. And we can see the floor layout. Just go, oh, and that thing's there. I'm not gonna sacrifice stuff. Well, that's no point. We will. Uh, we will, however, go to the shop if we find it. Okay, so we're now a a bad Abaddon. I really like the name Abaddon. 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 I think I'm gonna leave this room. Oh, is that Mum's contact? Or is that Mum's inner eye? Mum's eye. Mum's eye. Oh yeah. So occasionally. What that will do is we'll shoot eye tears from the back of our head, um, which is affected by a luck stat as well. So if we had the good luck, we'd have some really sweet tears right now. Um, so yeah, it's a chance for we can shoot tears out the back of our head. So unfortunately with a bad luck stat, fear and... Um, I'm glad we have a bit more speed now, though. That was that was kind of bugging me before. I will take that. <laughs> oh, I should have taken that first. That was dumb. I didn't even realize that was there before I took it then. Man, now I really wish I had a... Uh, I could still give money away. Whoa! Almost did what my typical uh, run across the entire room. What the hell? That was weird. Run across the entire room when you see those things come in. Te technique that I've perfected over time. What's down here? Ah! That's uh, luck down and that is speed down. Well, those are both really shitty pills. And I don't want them. Getting a lot of money here. This is the last floor there'll be any shops on as well. God, I wish I could give this money away. It happens every time when I can give money away. It's never there. It's never. It's never like working for me to give money to the donation machine. Oh yeah. Let's blow that up. Um. Okay. This isn't going to be too bad. It would be pretty annoying if I couldn't fly, but the fact I can fly means that that room's actually not awful. What's that thing hanging off my ear? Oh, that's a steam sail. Alright, what's up here? Oh man, look at those flies. That tech is really doing the work. Uh, right, let's... Have I missed any fake rocks? If I have, then uh, they've been missed, unfortunately. Right, let's check if this is a secret room. About this one. There it is. 48 hour energy. Meh. Nah. 
Mm, we could use the teleport thing, see where it takes us. It takes us back here, it's alright. <laughs> Nothing exciting. <laughs> there's, uh, there's no fire energy though, see where this one takes us. Literally right next to where we were a second ago. Alright, right, well, I'm not gonna... I don't, I'm not gonna waste time looking for the super secret room because... I don't, oops, that was a waste of a key, because I don't want to. Those aren't any use to me, because I can't take red hearts. I can, however, gamble away my life savings with this. Thank you, game. Will I sit here until I run out of money? You betcha. <laughs> oh boy, this is going to be interesting. Should I just let it go? Part of me says just let it go. Let it go. No, don't stop singing that song. Lemon party, hey! We could use that on the boss. Maybe uh maybe that'll be like a lemon party mum kill. I think I had one of those before actually. Oh come on, blow up. Blow up and give me uh give me what you got. Give me what you got, boy. Actually, extra keys would be okay. That's awesome. It's really good. Found pills. It's not really, and that's not really here or over there. Careful now. Don't try and don't get hit by that guy. Oh god. It's so hard not to just sit here and just gamble away everything in this game. I mean, I don't really have any other use for the money, so I mean, might as well. Unless I get money equals power, in which case, I will be mad. I will be mad if I get money equals power. I'm moving away because I have this tendency to get hit by the flies sometimes when they spawn from this. Thanks. That wasn't bad, it was just kind of annoying. Because <laughs> now it just means I have to travel all the way back to where I want to be. Oh, that was a waste of a key again. Thanks, game. You're really good at making me do that. Make me not sort of just pay attention and zone out. And then waste keys on things that I don't need to do. You want to blow up anytime soon? I'll go until you blow up. Key? That's alright. It's a pretty decent amount of keys. That should serve us well in the wound. Well, there you go. It blew itself up in the It didn't blew itself up. It didn't blew it blew itself up. Got blown up by a troll bomb. I was gonna use Lemon Party, but now I don't even feel like I need to. Uh we'll take that because we're going up. Up and up. I wanna get the D6 for Isaac. All right, let's try and uh, curse of the blind. What does that mean? Oh, it means we can't see what items there are, isn't it? R, isn't it? Okay, well let's just try and uh, let's try and make our way through here with, with uh, without hanging around too much. But let's not rush. Because every time I rush, I don't know what the fuck that is. That's not a good idea. Okay, I was gonna just teleport out, but now I kind of want to know what that is. I don't want to just pick it up with all the enemies around, so I'm gonna get rid of the enemies first. Whoa! Holy shit! Oh, really? Name. At least the Polaroid will go off every time we get a hit. What is this? Go ahead. Oh, guaranteed devil deal. That's a bit of a shame gives it to me now. Well, guaranteed devil or uh, angel room, I should say. But we can't get the angel room. Of course. Because of certain situations. Uh, do I want to? If I can... Uh, well, actually, yeah. I'm going to go in there, and then I'll use the teleport thing. Don't want to take any damage at all, then. And it put me in a room I've already been in. Okay. That's all right. I'm sorry I keep sniffling. I I, I don't know. I feel like there's something in my nose. It's not like something like I need to blow my nose. 
I've got this weird urge to sniffle right now. Maybe it's because I know I shouldn't be. Oh my god. Trying to find the fake rocks in the wound is so hard. That would take me to a secret room. Let's do that. Nice, that'll give me an extra heart, which uh, I actually don't need. Uh, which I, I mean, I might if I take a lot of damage, maybe, against the boss or whatever. Okay, so we've gone the wrong way here. We've got to go back uh, over to here. Oh, it's Mum's toenail. That makes uh, Mum's leg will appear every 60 seconds and stomp down randomly in the room, dealing 300 damage to enemies. And it, But it can stomp and hurt me. I'm not going to take it because I don't... I don't like the fact that it can hurt me. I've had it, I've had it before and I wasn't sure if it was hurting me and now I've had that confirmed. So... I want to have that one. I can't see any... I can't see any fake rocks anywhere. Oh, what's this going to be? Mirrored buddy. Oh, nice. Man, if I got something, like, really shitty, that would be so upsetting. <laughs> Something that like changes the way my run goes, and I'd be like, no. I'm always very wary of doing that. It's... Oh god, crap, shit. Well, that's annoying. It's all right though. I can go back and get my health back. It was a bit too late for me to realize what that was. Take me to that special place. Oh, okay, that actually saved me a bit of time. I wasn't sure like uh, where it was. I was maybe hoping I could just like warp to the room with it in. Okay, do I wanna No, let's just uh let's just get out of here. Let's just go go go. Now with the guppy's tail, I should actually get a lot of golden chests in the chest if we make it there. When we make it there, we make it there. Oh it's Mama Gurdy. Oh, I haven't fought Mama Gurdy well. Mama Gurdy's a bit of a joke when you have flying. What's it gonna be? Oh, we don't even know what the devil deals are going to be, do we? Oh, good. It's red chests. Ah. I mean that because that means I don't have to worry about what I'm picking up. Uh, what's this going to be? Tears and shot speed up. Hey, we need that. Our tear speed is actually pretty bad. All right, just don't be cursed the unknown, please. Or blind, or any curse. All right, Utero 2. Okay, let's try and make it through here without incident. Actually, I can go into the curse room, can't I? Because I can get out without taking damage. Let's see where it puts me. Wow, that's a lot of poo. <laughs> that is a lot of poo. Somebody who is some a scat. Somebody who is into scat porn right now is having a hell of a time. All right, that's a secret room. Could be here. Or here. Nice. Lots of money. Lots and lots of money. All right. Whoa. Okay. Careful now. I uh, I've taken damage from these guys a lot by accident. It's nice to have an able around, I guess. I kind of, kind of, a little bit confusing at times. I keep thinking that it's. I keep thinking he, someone's firing tears at me, and it's evil. Uh, okay, that's. Why is that one? I don't remember. Paralysis. I don't want that. Oh, hello. Hello again. I'm tempted to not spend much time here because. I just don't want to. I kind of want to get Scatoli from this guy, though. 
Although with my luck this bad, I really think the chances of me getting anything from him are pretty abysmal. There's even a luck down pill there just to really rub it in. Get like two rolls of that when we do this. Well, we're gambling at a pretty fast rate here. I think we'll burn for our money actually reasonably fast. Yeah, have we actually won anything from that yet? I got some bombs. Yeah, man, this is uh, this isn't going well. Come on. Come on, man. Give me some in here. Alright, well, that guy's done. He's out of here. Got a little bit more coins left. What are the chances of us getting Scatoli? They're pretty poor. I'll tell you that right now. I haven't even seen it pop up yet. I don't think this is going to happen. Look at them, they're not even, they don't even, they're not even winning anything. This is abysmal luck. Shame. I could blow him up, but I kind of want him to live in pain in the womb. I feel like killing him inside of this place would be a, would be doing him a favor, so I kind of want him to have to live out in misery in the womb. Right, what's going to happen in the arena? It's blood arena, so there's a good chance it could be an item. Get out of that. Oh, it's a uh, secret room we already found. <laughs> oh, some extra money could uh, could give us the scatoli that we want. I, I kind of want scatoli just because it will make fighting. There it is. Damn it, the dead baby uh, a little bit easier because it tends to spawn flies. So yeah, and any anything I can do to make it easier, regardless of how carried I may be in a run I will take mysterious paper I can never remember what mysterious paper does oh that's it okay so take a damage chance to deal damage to the entire room in the Necrocomicon style chance to trigger Polaroid or negative okay yeah that's one of those things helps you unlock the lost as well I think I'll take the wealth of wealth actually I should take that with me because it could let off the Necronomicon effect. I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna keep this with me until I finish the floor for the money, just in case I can go back to the beggar. Uh, I've already got free here, just for, so I can go back to the beggar and try and get uh, Scatoli. And then I will come back and I will take the mysterious paper. Once I have cleared the floor. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> go away. You're always down here. Right, let's go back and get Mysterious Paper. Spend these last ten coins. Uh, on the... Uh... Oh, actually. Uh, we'll take that with us until we've spent all of our chances. Just in case he drops any more extra money. Alright, you gonna give us Scatoli here or are you gonna play us like a fiddle? We're not gonna get what you want from you, am I? We're gonna get we're gonna get Nout. You're gonna you're gonna just joke us around until the very end, aren't you? Look, we're we're important people here. We're on a mission to beat... I, I don't know what I'm talking about. Sorry. <laughs> Let's just stop here before I start talking shite. As usual. Nope. How about... Last one, Scatoli? No. Enjoy dying, sir. Ah, of course I get some money. Typical. Ooh, no flies. Alright, let's go back, get the mysterious paper. There we go. And then let's get the hell out of here. 
still at least my least favorite part is of the uh, zappy eyes. All right, let's try and get this done fast. Oh, I took damage at the end there. Bullshit. <laughs> Man, that is some bullshit. I'm gonna go back and get that uh, heart. I, uh, yeah, I tried to move. Didn't move fast enough, unfortunately. Oh, nice. I'm glad it took me there. I was kind of worried it would put me in like an I Am Era room or something like that. I'd have no chance to get out. Right, here we go. Let's beat Isaac. This will give us the D6 as Isaac. This will curse of the unknown. I don't know what that does. I've forgotten. Right, I'm going to get the teleport charged up before I go in that room. Yikes. Oh boy, what a room. What a room for a man who doesn't have piercing tears, but has lots of flies will happily throw themselves at the enemy over and over again. Oh, because it means I don't see my health, doesn't it? Uh, that's actually totally useless to me. It's cool though, that we have basically have seen all the guppy items in this run. There's no point in me getting that, because I can't... It turns red hearts into soul hearts. I'd basically be sacrificing free soul hearts to gain no hearts. Uh, let's... See what we get from this. This actually might help us out. I was kinda I'm just kinda hoping that like I put me next to the boss room. Maybe it will. Okay, I don't want it to be it starts to veer me back again. I don't know if that's a good idea. Ah, nice. Okay. Well, let's do it. Come along. Almost there. Oh. Oof. So close. Nice. All right. D6 achieved. Is there really no achievement for not getting hit in there? Or did I get hit again and just not realize it? What's the curse this time? Oh, there's no curse. Okay. Alright. What are we going to get in these? It's health up. That's a reroll enemies in a room. That's the Dio. That's a little spider, but that's actually the first new item I got, I think. I always remember that. Little sp I can't remember what the name is called. She loves you? It loved you. She loves you. Sissy long legs. Yeah, she like, runs around dropping spiders. And uh, magnetic, which pulls in uh, pickups on the floor and move towards you. Yeah. Might as well. Those two are pretty useless to me, though. I mean, I can come back and get that if I take uh, some damage, I suppose. Um, that is the health up, right? I have to Check, check. I'm pretty sure that's just health up. You know what? I'm so confident it's just health up. I'm not even going to check. I'm just going to say it's health up. Uh, Dio. Let's see if we can get teleported straight to the boss. Get teleported here instead. Hey, maybe this will give us a card that will take us straight to the boss. Okay. World. That's actually pretty useful. Oh, wow. <laughs> Permit. And the future crystal ball will... Shit, I didn't mean to do that. I fucking pressed the wrong button then. Oh, it's a blank card. Ah, oh, shit. I pressed the wrong button. Kind of hate myself a little bit. I was right next to the boss. And then I accidentally pressed... I was meant to press the, the one for the space bar. And I pressed the one to trigger the card instead. Which triggered the hermit. Which of course teleported me... Uh, 
into a random room. Normally it would take me to the shop, I think. Oh, of course. Now we're going to see a bunch of items, I think. Right, that one is Sagittarius. Speed up. And we get piercing tears. That's pretty sweet. Uh. Wait, have I not actually been in that secret room? Oh no, I, I, I uncovered that secret room from the uh, world, didn't I? Oh, it's Dad's key! Oh my god, that actually lets us go to Mega Satan. Funnily enough. Wow, where are we now? Oh, we're up here. Wow. Okay. So, we could, hey, we could actually go to Mega Saiyan if we wanted to. Oh, it's Stigmata. That is a straight damage up, I believe. Damage and HP up. Okay. Oh, wow. This is, uh... This is gonna get into... I just... Oh, for fuck's sake. What? I panicked then. I thought I'd fucked everything up. <laughs> I have a really bad habit of doing that. Ugh. Oh, we're back here again. Yeah, so this will unlock that. That's cool. So we can definitely go and visit Mega Satan. I want to beat the dead baby first, of course. There's no advantage to visiting Mega Satan. Like, which is a shame there's no unlocks. For game Mega Saiyan. I guess it's because it would be kind of annoying. It's kind of a bit luck based whether or not you can get there. Whoa, that's close. Yeah, I'm starting to think there's no no hit achievements for these rooms, which is kind of weird. Oh, which one does that do? Adds, uh. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Toxic. When I tear to anything, they leave a toxic creep that damages enemies. Whilst apparently, hopefully, still being piercing. Yes, they just don't look piercing anymore. Right, cheese knees. Fuck this room. <laughs> oh, fuck this room as well. Actually, no, this room's alright. What's this room gonna be like? Um, okay. The best room in the world. These guys aren't the funnest people. Oh, it's Mr. Mega Boom! Mr. Mega, big blast damage. Alright, let's, uh... Let's do the dead baby. Ah, oh, really? Fucking damaged? Ah, oh, damn it. I wasn't paying attention to what was happening. I don't know. I'm just, Yeah, I don't know if those achievements exist anymore. Alright. Fate unlocked. Sweet. Let's uh let's do Mega Satan as well then, shall we? Oh Rosary! That gives us uh soul hearts. We might as well check out the rest of this floor. See what uh see what other items we can get from people. Mega um what are they called? Mega something. Oh, it's Attack Fly. Forever Alone. Oh, Jerdy Juniors. Jerdy Gooniers, I called them almost then. Jerdy Gooniers. Kamikaze. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. That would give us a, uh, a belt that we could use to blow ourselves up with, maybe, if you wanted. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, I don't like this guy. Not a big fan of these enemies. One, one, two of those I find kind of annoying, like challenging to do. Hello. The Bible. Not have any use to us here. In fact, using the Bible would get us killed <laughs> against any of these bosses. It would kill us instantly. Whoa! Don't throw a puke at me, buddy. Yeah, it's taking some silly damage, but it's not. I'm not too worried about it. Uh, this is Soul Heart over here. 
So, let's go and fight Mega Satan, shall we? That's a bit of health there. There we go. Let's do it. I'm ready. Bring it on, Mega Satan! Let's finish this runoff in style. Oh. Oh, oh yeah, okay, now we have to do the horseman. Yep. I don't I wonder if it's if it's possible to do enough damage for him to skip these phases. Oh Def, don't do that. Slow me down. That's not cool. Ow. Thanks. Let's get rid of that hand. Oh, okay, now we got the uh seven deadly sins to deal with. Be worse. Can always be worse. Oh god, I forgot there was four of them at once. I kind of hoping with the expansion that maybe they give Dark Mega Saint Dark Saint. What the hell's Dark Saint Mega Saint? Like maybe a more of a reason to be challenged. All right, the angels, the fallen angel fights. Actually, not any problem because of how overpowered we are. Whoa! Careful there, buddy. Get rid of that hand. Alright. Phase 2 of Satan coming up. Skeleton Satan. Skeleton Mega Satan. Oh, look, there's Abel. Hey, Abel. So this is the, uh, oh, Jesus, the bullet hell phase. That was kind of weird. That was also terrifying. It's kind of fun, actually. I quite like this, uh, the whole... Fuck. Well, that health phase. Taking some dumb damage there, but that's okay. And there we go. Yeah, we already had that ending. <laughs> Fate has appeared in the basement. Congratulations. Your fate. Has been defeated. I don't know. <laughs> Let's take a look, see at that. A wonderful dead baby win there. Yeah. Got to do Satan and the Lamb as the dead baby. Haven't been to the Lamb or uh, Satan in a while. So let's go and do that a couple times. But now we do have the D6 unlocked for Isaac, which is awesome. It's an awesome item to get. Still got many, many, many secrets to unlock. And still got a couple of items to get as well. Quite a few there, jeez. But, yep, thanks for watching, guys. 85 deaths. Most of those come from the Lost Runs. There's actually an item you get at 100 deaths, so... Keep that number coming up, actually. Well, most of that will come from Lost Runs, of course. Uh, but, yeah, thank you for watching. 123 secrets got. Of 173, wasn't it? Alright, thanks for watching. I will see you next time. Bye bye.